So welcome back guys and in today's video we're gonna do this comic book style effect here in Hit, Hit Film Express 14 and we're gonna do it right now. So I'm just gonna show you guys here's a clip uh, here's uh, a continuous play of the earlier one that I made. So after seeing that, uh, I thought to myself that I would not make that kind of uh, design. I'm gonna make it better. So it's actually quite okay and pretty easy to do. It just has uh, a lot to do in it. It's quite tricky. Uh, it's not that tricky. It's just easy. So we're gonna make a new composite shot. Uh, make that uh, into 30 seconds. I'm not really sure. Yeah, just make that 30 seconds. And I'm gonna rename this to comic book style and there you go this is pretty nice for some uh, for example the clip that I use here it's actually good for uh, like one of those pre pre wedding stuffs that people do so let's say uh, let's say walking alone Okay, so let's say we have this one. So we're just gonna resize this. And we're just gonna do this. Okay, so let's say I would want that to be second. I want this to be first. Okay, so the problem is there's no style and uh, there's no art into this. So let's say I would want uh, to mask this uh, let's say I would want that there 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 and there just to have that weird shape and in here I would just want that to be like this okay okay I'm just gonna zoom that in okay too much so let's say I would want it oh no okay and nice so let's say I would want that that okay I could just move it a bit more there okay and there you go so you could just move that a bit the purpose of the mask is to have that like comic book style uh, blackness let's add a new layer plain and let's color that to black and rename this to BG and I'm just gonna put that underneath and lock this layer so let's say we would have that and what we could do is we're gonna change the height a bit let's say 1920 unlock the BG the background and scale that up okay and I'm gonna lock that again so let's say I have this two here I'm just gonna put that on top and we could do also uh, walking in place okay we could just add this together so let's say I would want uh, this one here okay so as you can see here I'm leaving a gap for each one and let's say I would want this clip okay so that's pretty nice and the next thing we'll do uh, the last thing uh, we're gonna need is this clip right here okay I think this is too big so I'm just gonna mask uh, this one okay I'm gonna need this part 
and we're just gonna move this a bit up okay and there you go so the uh, clip here I'm just gonna shrink this down so let's say I would want this one to be vertical just for uh, this example Eight. so let's say I would want it that way so now that I have done that okay let's just wait okay there you go so now that we have done that uh, let's first let's color code this one I'm gonna change the color this one is tomato this one's dark this one's uh, sapphire blue and this one's uh, opera mauve I don't know how to say that I'll just call it pink so the purpose of this one is to make it easier so the first one uh, we're just gonna hide all of those is this one so the first thing we'll do is control shift D and we're just gonna have to do this forward and control shift D I move a frame after uh, the clip so we have that one and search for the add get this tool here at the rate stretch tool or s and then stretch it all the way up to the end so that it won't move the next thing we'll do go to effects and search for fill color fill color and we're just gonna put that in here and change the color to black change the blend mode amount to 75 we could do 70 I guess yes and there you go so when you when that reaches there it would darken and it's supposed to play the other video so we have that so we won't be touching that for a while let's just lock that for a while and I'm gonna use this walking uh, clip so zoom in first and then move this clip here don't forget to go back to your uh, what do you call this move tool uh, select selection tool okay so let's say I'm just gonna move that a frame and get the rate stretch tool and stretch this all the way then we're gonna add, we're just gonna copy this uh, we're just gonna copy this fill color control C lock this again and I'm just gonna control V that so that it would be easier so the first part it would be dark and then it would play in here okay so there you go so let's say I would want a three seconds for that one or let's say I would want just that let's just put it to three seconds control D okay control move a frame forward and then go to rate stretch tool and stretch that all the way also control V it will be dark also okay and we could do that in the next one so just move to the last frame that this one's moving so let's say that okay and let's say let's just move that a frame a frame okay control shift D I'm locking this so that I would I wouldn't accidentally press these so when I press this okay so the rate stretch tool again control V for that it's actually easy if you already copied your fill color it would be easier so let's say I would want five seconds of that or we could just delete this okay just find the part that you would want it I'm just gonna say I'm gonna want it to be right there okay so let's say I would want that here ok 
okay so moving that a frame uh, backward okay so rate stretch tool okay and control V and then let's say I would want it there control D move a frame forward control D delete this one and stretch it all the way to the end control V and we could have uh, we could move back move to the selection tool again and we're gonna do this wait too much okay control shift D rate stretch tool control V and go to selection tool go to uh, any point that you would like uh, let's say I want seven seconds oh I forgot to view this I thought it was just uh, my laptop logging and I'm just gonna control D move a frame forward control D control shift D actually and just do this rate stretch tool again and control V so so let's see okay 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 so I'll show you this is the result so what you what can you say is it easy or hard let me down let me know down in the comments below and this is actually very nice for some uh, storytelling vibe uh, comic book style or somewhat uh, heist type so just let me know on what you think about this like uh, like click the like button if you like this kind of content comment down below on what you think or any suggestions for future videos subscribe to my channel if you really want to learn more or you just want to support me and i would see you in the next video bye <music>